previous tutorial was crude operation in ASP.NET C Sharp with uh, SQL. Let's insert a record. Student ID 108. It's not exist in the grid view. Name Jackie, age 25, Canada, male. Yes, successfully inserted. Now, in this tutorial, I will show you how to check student ID exists or not in the database before insert in ASP.NET C Sharp with SQL. Insert. Yes, it's now it's not checked. It's directly random error. Primary key cannot insert duplicate key in the object. To avoid this error, I am adding a checkpoint to check whether the student ID exists or not in the SQL Server database. So this is the student info tab, table name and programming db is the database name. Let's check the database and table in the SQL Server. Yes, expand the programming db, expand the table. Yes, this is the student info tab, table name. Let's check the design of this table. You can see student ID, this is primary key column and data type is integer. Okay, now just copy the sql command uh, yes and paste after the connection open okay sql command change the command uh, com to check student id okay new sql command this is to select student id so select student id from student id column name student id student id from student info tab higher student id equal to single quotation double quotation close that uh, double quotation and break yes now put plus sign and then uh, student id in the text box one so text box one dot text student id is integer type you can see data type is integer so you should uh, convert the text box to integer integer dot first text box one dot text initialize the connection string con okay see that this is the connection string as well connection i have shown it in the previous tutorial crude operation in sp.net situation with sql okay now sql data adapter is equal to new sql data adapter and come to check status okay it's done now declare data table data table dt equal to new data table sd dot fill dd okay now if dt dot rows dot count greater than zero i mean if the record exists in the sql server database table then it will display a message just copy this message and paste it in the if condition now change the message message will be already exist student id if the student id exists in the sql server database table else if the student id does not exist in the database table then it will execute the insert command okay now it's done go to the default.spx so right click and view in browser yes now I'm gonna insert uh, 108 record which is already exist uh, in the SQL Server database table. You can see in the grid view below. Insert. Yes, you can see it's displaying message already exist student ID instead of error. Okay. What message I just uh, put uh, in the if condition count greater than zero. The message uh, displaying when I insert in try to insert duplicate record. If it's 109 which is not exist in the SQL database table, then it's inserted successfully. You can see in the grid B109 Jack UK 55 perfectly working. Let's check the records in the database table. Yes, Jack UK, the records also available in the SQL database table. Thanks for watching this tutorial.